Good evening, I'm Antonia Singot. The United States, through its Agency for International Development, has given valuable support to boost PNG's response to the multi-drug resistant tuberculosis and HIV. U.S. Ambassador to PNG Catherine Herbert Gray today presented valuable high-quality medical equipment worth 300,000 kina to the National Capital District Commission Health Authority and Western Province. Deputy Health Secretary Dr. Paisen Dakulala thanked the U.S. government for its continued support in response to these epidemics. Bradley Gregory reports. A small crowd gathered at the Lost Road Clinic in Port Mosby for the presentation. In attendance were representatives from FHI 360, Department of Health and the U.S. Embassy. The U.S. government, through its Agency for International Development, has given valuable medical equipment to boost PNG's fight towards multi-drug-resistant tuberculosis and HIV in PNG. The goal of achieving an AIDS-free generation is a shared responsibility with partner countries in this central convening world. Neither the United States nor any other single entity can accomplish this goal alone. It requires all our partners to intensify their efforts to effectively coordinate financing and technical support to implement programs both inside and outside of the health sector. Uh, two gene expert machines, two centrifuge machines, uh, two CD4 machines, or is it four? Four blood pressure machines uh, and the cap ranges for CD4 1000 uh, and 2000 gene expert, BDR rotator. Hey, that's a whole lot of beautiful equipment. I've been a clinician and I know what it means. The National Capital District and Western Province will use these equipments. State of the art, the equipments cost about 300,000 US dollars. One of the important equipments that was donated will be used to detect the drug-resistant TB, which at the moment the country doesn't have. That, that's given uh, in the Daru setting will, will enable us to, to find the, um, the forms of, of uh, resistant forms of TB and then get, get these patients on, on treatment. Uh, the, the sort of equipment that we have in terms of the HIV AIDS support, it's, it's to do with uh, trying to identify the progress in many of our patients who are on treatment. Dr. Dakulala continues that fighting diseases or sicknesses is everybody's business and to have such partners come on board was a bonus. Bradley Gregory, NBC National News, Port Mosby.